whatever the ending is, it'll be uh, epic and cataclysmic. I think John, he's had it rough. <laughs> he's had a rough few years, to be fair to him. He died and he thought that was it. And then he didn't and he's back and he fought and he's fought and he's fought and he's lost friends, he's lost family. Yeah, no, he, if anyone deserves a happy ending. I think Tyrion would be, would, uh, be a good person to occupy that seat. I don't know how, but that, that way he would be, because I think given what he's been through and the skills that he has, he'd probably be the best, uh, the best ruler, the best leader. Tyrion seems to be the, the one who could, might want to, and probably might do a good job. So I can't really see anyone else uh, that I would vote for. I think everyone else has a tendency to go bonkers and just <laughs> become a dictator. Surely not a Targaryen. After all that, <laughs> you never know. Tyrion is kind of the obvious choice, so I don't think it's gonna happen. Even though I would like it to happen, I don't think it's gonna happen. It would be nice in a way to see possibly a sisterhood, maybe Arya and Sansa together. I think they're kind of two sides of the same coin or something and together might be quite strong. The Arya Stark, I, I thought it would always seem somehow not only right, but in tone with the world that she would end up, but then we wouldn't know what was gonna happen. Everyone's dead for a start. Everyone's gonna die. I think Daenerys is gonna have some weird kind of dragon Jon Snow baby because everybody knows if you have sex on television even once you always get pregnant. I don't know, maybe that child prodigy, whatever it is, will sit on, I don't know. Or maybe, hmm, or maybe it will come out and kill them all. I think it's gonna be pretty brutal, but is everybody gonna be killed? I don't think everybody can be killed, can they? I remember remembering something George R. R. Martin said about something just uh, just snow or winds or something like that and everything blown to annihilation or something like that. I have no idea and I just want to be surprised by it really. But then I just feel like this green shoot through the ash and I don't know what that green shoot is. I'm just like a glimmer of hope. It's got to be bittersweet because you can't please everyone, especially if you want to be bold. And the one thing we can guarantee is that there's going to be something bold happening. <laughs> I use the word bold as in, you know, you're not going to miss that. I really like the idea that we saw the ending years ago when Daenerys goes to that building and she sees the Iron, she sees the iron Throne covered in snow and the room like decimated. I really like the idea that since series two we've known how it's going to end. I love that, that we've just been watching and it's all been pointless, we've seen it all before. <laughs> <laughs>